What is up YouTube? Welcome back to another Demonologist video. We're going to have a fun one today. We've got custom mode. I am basically a god now. I am untouchable. I'm basically unkillable. The ghost can still kill me, but I'm super fast and everything is just in my favor. So this is going to be the first episode. I'm probably not going to do these in order, by the way. I'm just going to do them kind of as they come kind of thing. But it's going to be the first episode of finding out about each ghost type. So I don't know what ghost we're going to get. I can't select them, unfortunately, which is kind of annoying. So we're going to go in with the normal sort of stuff like we always do. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Actually, do we want... Yeah, we might as well take that in. Anyway. I'm super fast. I, I'm just a flash. I cannot believe how fast you even when you're walking. So the idea on this one... Also, uh, lights don't break either. So the idea on this one is going to be that we're going to find out what the ghost is and then we're going to read its description and then we're going to see if we can work some things out and try and kind of nail each ghost, like their characteristics, everything. Just just kind of give like a... It's almost like a beginner's guide. It's not, but you know what I'm saying. It, it's to help out new people and advanced people as well because realistically, I still don't know everything about these ghosts. And there is, there is often... Okay, you're in the middle. There is often a lot of things that I do forget as well. All right, so you're in here. You got any Ecto? Pretty active. I'm kind of hoping it's a Thay or something, honestly. If it's a Thay, that would be absolutely perfect. Holy bananas. All right, well, I'm not seeing Ecto anywhere at the moment. But yeah, can you imagine if this is a Thay or something? Did I? Oh, it's a Nama. Yeah, it's a Nama. What the hell? Yeah, it's a Nama. It's got to be a Nama. All right, hang on. So we got a Nama because I did. I definitely didn't put my thing there. So, right. It is known to be a thief ghost. It has been observed that it behaves calmly to avoid attracting attention and prefers to stay in the dark. It is seen that it relocates the tools. With its slyness, it can steal the tools on the ground, even the tools you hold. If the lights are on, it will turn them off before stealing the tools. If the tools are in the salt barrier, it won't be able to steal them. Ah, okay. Well, let's do some testing here. So this light is always on. No, this light is here. Right, well, I'll tell you what, what we do, let's just put all these, pull, let's put them all down here. Realistically, it's a Nama, so we should be, we should be fine. Um, I kind of want to see what, how it, when it hunts. Wow, this thing is active, but I think that's because I'm on easy. Well, it's custom mode, so when you put it on custom mode, it's always easy. Right, let's put all that stuff there. Let me go get salt barrier quickly. We'll check our sanity. I kind of want to see when it hunts as well. 95%. Okay, I'm still way high. Let's do salt barrier. Um, I kind of just want to put everything in there. What else do I do? Crease fix, maybe? I, why not? I guess. Might as well. Um, so the light being... I, I actually didn't even think, remember, or know the fact that the light has to be off for it to steal something. I feel like it's stolen stuff before. I feel like it's stolen stuff before and the light has been on. Well, let's drop this in here. Drop this here. So, are we are we saying that basically... So, this is the light on, right? Does it have to be in the light? Or does it have to be just the, the room where the light is, basically? So, would this cow, do you think? I think it should do, but who knows. Let's leave those two there for a minute. We're 95%. I would like to know when it's going to start hunting as well, to be fair. Uh, let me drop that there. I'll keep this on me because why not? I mean, realistically, we'll see if it disappears. Uh, actually, to be fair, it won't take it unless it turns the light off, right? So we're just going to have to do a lot of waiting. This is going to be the problem here. Because realistically, we're not we're not going to know. Maybe I need to start doing this on Nightmare, maybe. It'd be more, it'd be more trickier to try and work out the ghost, but... Or to try and not die to the ghost, I guess. I'm not sure. I don't know what the play is here. But realistically, it should... So it shouldn't take these things. I feel like it's already taken something. Why do I feel like it's already taken something? That looks like there's loads less in there now. Let's just have a little, little walk around the map. Just make sure I'm not missing anything. Anything in there? I don't think so. So technically, nothing should move because the lights are on. That's that's what it's telling me, right? Anything up here? I cannot believe how fast we are. <laughs> Crazy. 
Uh, let's turn this. We might as well just turn all the lights on, right? We've got the secret hideout. No, no magic there. All right, so we've got three lots of Ouija boards as well, apparently. Uh, let's do that. Hello. How's it going? Having a good time meditating. That's fine. Don't mind me. I'm not really bothered about you. I'm looking for the Nama. All right, I don't think it's taken anything. Not yet, at least. Um, I'm going to assume this doesn't class as a light being on. This is darkness, right? Which makes sense. Because it did steal something, right? Wait. Did I turn the light on when I first come in? Because how did my Ouija board disappear? Because the light would have been on. Or did I only just turn the light on? I'm not sure. But so far, nothing is missing, I don't think. I don't think. Let me turn. Let me let me go get more stuff. Check our sanity as well. It's probably still 90%, by the way. 88%. Oh, God. It's going to be here a while. All right, let's do this. Let's do another easel as well. Uh, or a candle. Candle's fine. At least that way we know if the candle's been taken. But let's put this here as well. Put that there. Uh, I guess maybe I can put it like all the way down. So it won't steal anything while the light's on, is, is what it's saying. So technically, none of this should get stolen. The question is, is it just the light or is it like the room that counts? That's what that's what matters. So in the darkness, so this is in darkness, this isn't in light. Will it get stolen? That's the question. Uh, so it says, if the lights are on, it will turn them off before stealing. I think it's just based on the room. Which would make sense. Yeah, that would make sense, to be fair. Sweeping. Okay. You know what I'm just thinking? Is it definitely a Nama? I'm, I'm pretty certain it is. Uh, wait, we got... It can't be a Nama. Because it's freezing. Wait, what? But I didn't move the... Or did I move the weed? The I'm so confused. I'm so confused. I'm there thinking it's a Nama. Oh, we're raining. Uh, sweet Jesus, freezing. Oh, good God. There's me messing about. I'm just, I'm just silly. I'm just silly. I swear I didn't move that. Pause. Yeah, talk to me. Uh, but I don't know what you are now. That down. What on earth is it doing? No, it's freezing, so I don't know why I picked that up. Uh, I guess I could put that there. Put that there. Realistically, we should get everything now, really. Oh, my goodness me. I'd have been there for ages as well, by the way. Um... I, I'm pretty certain it wasn't Ecto. Uh, yeah, talk to me. Talk to me. Freeze. Pause. Okay, you don't want to give me a five just yet. I don't think it's a boogie, because so I feel like it would turn on every light source in the world. Uh, Manifest, can you show yourself? Manifest, can you show yourself? Uh, let's do that. This again. And give me this again. I don't think it's done any of the light sources. Ah, uh, the doors here. Let's check for Ecto again. I'm pretty certain it's not Ecto, so I think it's not a Raiju. Oh, you aren't keen on getting yourself killed. I'm very keen on getting myself killed. Come on, bring it. I dare you. You won't do it. You won't do it. You're too scared. Uh, oh, wait. Oh! ESG. Okay, so definitely not Ecto, but yes to ESG. Oh, it's a gin. Oh, uh, okay. That's interesting. So let's check our sanity. So gin should tank your sanity more, right? Also, they, they are... This is going to be good testing for how often you see a gin. Oh, wow. Okay, yes. Yes, yes, yes. That is definitely tanked my sanity. This is going to be interesting, though. So we can see how much sanity 
strain the gin does. So let's go back up to 100 again. Back up to 100. Give me this. Let's just read a gin description quickly. The gin. Jins are known to be more active than other ghosts. Makes sense. It has been observed that they're more active if someone is nearby. Makes sense. Because it is very active ghost, it is prone to hunting. Okay. Because it is very active, it reveals itself quickly. Okay. It doesn't say anything about doubling the sanity drain, which is interesting. Um, I, I'm going to bring candles in. Mainly to see if it blows out the candle. So every time it does something now, we're going to go run and see what our sanity is. That's that's the plan here. Barbara, I ain't got time for you right now. We're doing investigations. Let's do this. Okay, I've got this. Okay, can you give me a sign? Can you give me a sign? If anything happens, we're going to quickly sprint. Even if it's ESG. I don't think ESG is going to count, but even if it is. Can you give me a sign? Okay. Any any more? Okay, cool. I'll be back. So let's go quickly check. So I would have been, what, 95 worst case scenario? Okay, so that didn't do anything. So are we classing that as a ghost event then, or are we classing that as an interaction? Interesting. Okay. I don't want to select a ginger yet because I don't want it to... I automatically hunt. Yep, I got that. Let me just make sure I get it on the EMF. Where was it, though? Right here. Let me move that bowl. Right, let's go check. We definitely were in range of that bowl. So let's see if that does anything. Um, I know it's custom easy mode, so maybe it's kind of skewed a little bit. Uh, it dropped a percent. Literally one percent. I feel like... Something made me tank. Was it the voice line, maybe? Maybe it was the voice line. I'm not sure. You know what I need? I need, I need another EMF. Can you give me a sign? Can you give me a sign? Uh, let's, see if, let's see if the candles work. Blow out the candle. Can you blow out the candle? Okay, it's just blown it out. Let's just go check to see if that does anything. I'm going to guess no as well. Let's have a look. What? <laughs> Apparently it went up. Apparently it went up after it blew the candle out. Uh, okay, I think I think sometimes it jumps up and down. So I think that's probably what that was. But sweet Jesus, that made no sense. Um, okay, let me put the EMF down. Uh Yep. Hello. Anger. Anger. Uh, okay. Double interaction right now. Double interaction. Let's go check. So we just had two interactions. Let's see. Let's see if that has any effect on our sanity at all. We would have been around, what, 94-ish percent? Yes, it did. Okay. The question is, what what was it, though? Was it the rain or was it the picture? We've definitely dropped about 20% there. I feel like that wasn't one each. I don't, I don't think that was a 10 and a 10. I think that was a singular one. I think that was a 20%er. All right, let's see if we can get it again. Can you give me a sign? Can you give me a sign? Uh, okay, it's blowing out the candle again. Double check. I don't. I don't think so. I don't think candle has any bearing on the sanity drop whatsoever. No, definitely not. Sixty nine. Nice. All right, let's do food and paper. Actually, you know what? Let's do this. Let's take pills. Let's get back up to hundred again. Because realistically, if we want to tank the sanity, we can just use we can just use Ouija board. We got three of them, so we should be fine. All right, let's do... I'm back up to 100. Let's food and paper this. Let's see what happens. Can you give me a sign? The food and paper... Do it. I think that was exploding head. I think that's a ghost 
event rather than an interaction. Let's just double check it though. For just scientific purposes, we're going to check everything. That, that definitely didn't do anything. Apart from, like, almost give me a heart attack, that didn't do anything. Alright, cool. That's fine. We need to keep an eye on these pictures as well, but I think we should be fine. Okay, can you give me a sign? Blow out the candle again. Candles definitely have no bearing on anything. Can you give me a sign? Yeah. Talk to me. Is it this one? Fives. Makes sense. Okay. That was a voice line and a bowl being thrown. Let's see what my sanity is. I would have been 95%. Don't know. I really hope it's not too low. Is it the voice line? That's only 10%. Oh, no. It's probably about 15. Is it the voice line that's doing it? Oh, it's about 20, you know. Is it the voice line that's doing that? That's the question. I'm not sure. I wish I'd have sprinted to go and check. Can you give me a sign? I feel like you just turned the light on or off. You did just turn the light on or off. Can you give me a sign? I think it's that one. Can you give me a sign? Where are you? Manifest, can you show yourself? I don't want ESG to happen here. Manifest, can you show yourself? Manifest, can you show yourself? I think that's Ghost Inter uh, Ghost Event. Let's double check it, though. So I would, again, be 100%. 95 worst case scenario. So let's see if that actually does anything. I didn't do anything. Okay. So that doesn't class as a ghost interaction. That's a ghost event, I think. That's just telling us where the room is. Can you give me a sign? I don't want it to speak. Because then I can go test. I can go check. Can you give me a sign? Manifest, can you show yourself? Can you give me a sign? Where are you? Can you show yourself? Okay. Let's go check. I'm pretty certain that, that doesn't count. That won't count towards anything, I don't think. So we would have been, what, 95-ish again? Probably a little bit lower. Yeah, that didn't do anything. Makes sense. Okay. That's crazy. Okay. I need vocals. Can you speak? Can you talk? You want to talk to me? Hello, ghost. Can you speak? Can you talk? Where are you? Would you like to talk? Do you like ducks? Do you like anything? Do you like talking? Can you give me a sign? Okay. ESG. Okay. Hang on, hang on. Oh, flies. You see that? Hang on. What's my sanity? Oh, all right. We can see the gin in action, though. Let's have a look. I went through the salt. Damn it. I wonder if my... Did my sanity just take a hit? Is that why it just hunted? I feel like the, the gene wouldn't have hunted at, like, 80%. No way. What the... What just happened? I had just lost 75%. What? Oh my goodness. That must be the highest sanity drop I've ever had, ever. I'm on custom mode, by the way. I have just had a 75% drop. What the hell just happened? That one interaction. It was a big one, but that one interaction. I thought that was a ghost event. What else did it do? It just hunted straight after, didn't it? It didn't do anything else. That's crazy. I have just lost 75% sanity. So that means that all those other times, those interactions that did happen, they, they were working. It must be a random chance then. It must be a random chance for it to drop your sanity. I'm so confused.
It didn't speak. I didn't hear any voice line, so it can't be that. I'm so confused. I've just lost 75% sanity. And it did one interaction slash ghost event. All right, what do we got here? I need to I need to select Jin. To... That's very interesting. That's very interesting. Can you blow out the candle? All right, where are you though? Where are you? Oh, you're in there, you creepo. Right, let's have a look. Okay, you can definitely see that for a long time. Also, I feel like Jin's are... I know, I, I know I'm walking fast. Yeah, the salt worked again, okay. Um, can you blow out the candle? Can you blow out the candle, blow out the candle, blow out the candle? Yeah, that really can you blow out the candle? Um, I don't think we're going to need... Oh, you know what? I might need it if it's a dead end. Got, any, got anything in here for me? Tana, thank you very much. Uh, what way was that? That was down. So I think that one was to the right, I think. If Tana's in here. A lot of Ouija boards. Uh, what one have I got? I have the rabbits. There. Which is the cow. Uh, which is the plant. I'm missing a bear. Uh, she's the right way round. What's reading book man doing? He's a man as well. I am missing a katana. Have you seen it? Looking for katanas. Uh, any katana? Oh, are you in here now? Oh, you little sneak. Interested, okay. So, I'm still not entirely sure what caused my drop. So maybe it's a big ghost event. Maybe it's a big ghost event. Okay. Okay. Oh my goodness, where did you spawn? It spawned on top of me. It definitely blinks for a long time though. One, two, three. Three seconds. One, two, three. Salt worked. Salt worked again? <laughs> Christ, three times. You get so lucky on the uh, custom easy mode. Let's get this out of the way with. Uh, that was to the right, I think. That was upside down. I just blown out the candle. Oh, wait, no, maybe this. This one? Go. Okay. Let just get these done. Keep crucifix on me because I'm probably going to die. I'll get really unlucky in it. It seems to be teleporting towards me, which is interesting. That's that's two times now. It's hunt Well, three times it's hunted. It's hunted in exactly the same spot that I've been in. Which is intriguing. So I wonder if we can do that again. What are we looking for now? The mask? The Oni mask? You up here? Ah, look how cool that looks, by the way. Does look cool without the massive hand in the middle. All right, let's see. Okay, it did. Don't tell me the salt's gonna work again. No, I didn't think so. Okay, have a look. One, two, three. It's about three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. It's a shame that I'm that much faster. Maybe I need to change it to 1.5. Because I feel like 2 is too fast. Can we hide from this thing just out of interest? I'm going to guess we can't. Way. Did we lose it? I don't know if we lost it. By crouching. I feel like it was running away at that point. Okay. Interesting. Uh, that's something new. 
I guess we'll grab the Ouija board quickly. Oh, there was one there. I thought there was. All right, let's. Uh, I want to stand over here to see if it spawns in this area. What's this? Where are you? Right. Okay, you're there. Right, let me. Let me see. I'm gonna crouch. Okay. You know where I am. Over here. Do you know where I am? I think you do. Where I am? Yeah, I'm pretty certain it does. I think it does. Okay, it's fine. Okay. Yeah, it definitely it def definitely seems to blink for ages. It definitely blinks for ages. I feel like I see it constantly. Yeah, there we go. That's done. Um all right, cool. I I feel like we didn't learn a great deal then. Not really. Although something definitely destroyed our san sanity. 75%. But one thing is for certain, I'm pretty certain that the ghost does definitely um, hunt, like the blinking lasts a lot longer. So we do see it for a longer time. Kind of want it to hide and just see if it, if it finds me for whatever reason. Also, just proof that this light makes no difference. Of whatever. I say that and it's probably going to come in and kill me now, but... If you have the light on in a locker or if you're hiding anywhere, the light has no bearing. It, it, the ghost still doesn't know where you are, which doesn't really make much sense to me. I think they should change it. So, so it's like in Faz, basically. Um, but yeah, something definitely tanked my sanity. 75%. Even on Nightmare, even on Nightmare, the gin does not tank my, or has never tanked my sanity that much. That's absolutely ridiculous. 75% imagine going into a nightmare game just starting out and you lose 75% of your sanity oh my goodness that would be a tough game but at least I suppose on the flip side you'd know it'd be a gin you'd know it'd be a gin no other ghost is going to tank your sanity 75 only tank your sanity but not 75% normally it's about normally I think the threshold is about 50 Onis will tank it down to about 50% so they can hunt. What is this gin doing? Is it even coming near me? But there we go. Flashlight makes no difference at all. Um, but yeah, so if you get more than like... If your sanity... Oh, here's a thing, actually. I'm, I'm pretty certain... Again, we'd have to test it when we get the Oni. But I'm pretty certain... I definitely didn't come this way. I'm pretty certain that an Oni tanks your sanity down to roughly 50%. It doesn't go any lower than that. I don't think. I think it's a threshold for an Oni where it can't drop it any lower than 50%. In the back of my mind, I can't think of a time where Oni has dropped it lower. It's not necessarily the case. We need to test it. But that's what I think. So basically, if you get a ghost that drops your sanity below 50%, like out of nowhere, so let's say you're 70% and you drop down to 40%, the chances are it's probably a djinn. I think a hantu can also curse you. So a hantu could potentially... I think a hantu has dropped me down to about 40% before. But I'm pretty certain Oni has never dropped me below 50%. Now that I think about it, I'm pretty certain it's always been like 53, 56. That's interesting. We'll have to test that. That is something we're going to have to test. But if you get something that drops your sanity below 50%, there is a good chance it could be a Jin or a Hantu. I don't think anything else can drop your sanity that much. I don't think. Not 75%. That's ridiculous. But it's going to get very loud, by the way. Get out of there so we don't... Ears don't start bleeding. But okay. Interesting. Very interesting. Um, what did we learn? Not a lot. Obviously blinking. Definitely blinking. Um... I would say that it felt like it blinked a lot more. Maybe I'll notice it on the next one that we do and I'll see how often the ghost blinks. But for some reason, I just feel like the, the gin, you definitely see it a lot more. Um, 
the 75% sanity thing was interesting. The, the reason it did that, it did the interaction with the, the flies. You know, I saw the flies. I don't know how we're still getting ESG, by the way. Um, also, look at that tree. It's... Oh, it looks like it's alive. It looks like it's like... Oh, that's weird. I don't know if I like that. Um, yeah, I don't know what that interaction was. I feel like we've had that once before, though. But I would have put that down to a ghost event, not a ghost interaction. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. Well, realistically, the gin isn't too difficult to work out. Um, you kind of know a gin just from the blinking. The blinking alone should be enough to kind of guess whether it's a gin or not. But the sanity drain, I think we're onto something with the 50% or lower. I think we're onto something there. But we won't know until we do the Oni. Interesting. All right, let's go to the post game. Uh, it's 0% multiplier, so I'm going to guess we have no money or no rewards. But let's just go to the post game anyway. And there we go, guys. Gin. Obviously, it had to have been. But there we go. Zero on everything. Worth risking our life for zero. Keep in mind, if I would have died, then I'd have lost all my items as well. So it definitely would not have been worth it. But okay. We didn't learn quite so much as what I'd like of, like to. Considering it's uh, it's quite a long video. I might have to edit it down for you guys. But interesting. That 75% really threw me out. I was honestly expecting like a 20%, 30% drop. 75 is a lot. So I don't know what caused it. Apart from that one interaction or ghost event. But I think we're onto something with the 50%. And the ghost definitely blinks a lot longer than other ghosts. Without a doubt. Or a lot less than other ghosts. So you can see it a lot more. So if you notice that you see the ghost more while it's hunting. You can see it a lot more. And you know where it is basically at all times. Chances are it's probably a gym. Not always, but chances are it's probably a gym. But there we go, guys. We're going to leave it there. Only one, like I said, I'm going to try and do dedicate one video to each ghost. Um, this wasn't this wasn't exactly concrete evidence on some stuff. But I feel like it is still helpful for you guys, especially like um, especially beginners, to be fair. So that, that blinking thing, I think, will help a lot of people. Um, but the sanity drain. Keep in mind, I, I am definitely going with, if it drops it below 50%, it's more likely to be a Jin than an Oni. I'm, I'm going with that until we do the Oni test. So take it with a pinch of salt, grain of salt, whatever you want to do. But we're going to leave it there, guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did enjoy, you know what to do. Smash the like button. It helps our channel loads. And if you want to see more content like this, it doesn't necessarily have to be demonologist. doesn't necessarily have to be ghost hunting. Anything horror-based, consider subscribing. We have a ton of videos on the channel already. I will have a ton more as well. So you will enjoy it. But yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching. Have a lovely rest of the day. I'll catch you in the next one.